Today we have a birthday haul. My birthday was this past Saturday, March 23rd. I turned 27 years old. This was my first birthday with a baby. I have a four and a half month old. She's coming up on five months, which is honestly insane. Um, my birthday was great. Thank you so much to anyone who wished me a happy birthday. I really, really appreciated it. My husband and I actually did a 5K on the morning of my birthday. We did it with my cousin Sally. It was the Chick-fil-A chicken biscuit run. <laughs> and um, it was really fun. I had like a new 5K personal best, which was 40 minutes and four seconds or 41 minutes. Mm, I don't even remember now. Hang on. I posted about it on Instagram, so let me check my caption. 41 minutes and 4 seconds was my time. My husband ran it with me. He could have done much faster, but he decided to hang out with me and run, which I really appreciated. So that was really exciting. Um, we went shopping. We went to lunch with my parents. We went to P.F. Chang's, and it was so freaking good. I love P.F. Chang's. I like picked. To go there every year for my birthday um but yeah it was a really 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 good birthday and um i can't can't complain i got some really fun stuff so i thought that i would do a little birthday haul i will link the things that i can i know there's like a couple things that i can link um but we have stuff from my parents and then also from jarvis so I'll start with what Jarvis got me. He actually got me a new pair of running shoes. I was so excited. I don't have them yet. I went to First Place Sports, which is in Jacksonville, Florida. If you are in the Jacksonville area, definitely check out First Place, First Place Sports. They put on a ton of the races around Jacksonville. Um, but I went to the one on Bay Meadows and actually got like fitted for shoes because I guess running shoes are very specific and there's a lot of different things that you need to take into account when getting running shoes. So I got a new pair of running shoes. The last time I bought them, I didn't get fitted, but um, I told the guy like what shoes I have and he actually like had brought out a pair of those after he like did the little feet scan thing and looked at like my posture and whatever. So I guess I did good picking out a pair of shoes on my own, but I had the Clifton 8s from Hoka, which I love them. I don't have any complaints. I have really high arches though. So basically he said I have neutral feet and high arches. So I need like high arch support and like high cushion. So I ended up getting these shoes right here i will pop up a picture they're from new balance and they are so incredibly comfortable i don't think i've ever put on a shoe so comfy <laughs> so um, i love the color they are pink they actually didn't have the pink in store i tried on a different colorway which was honestly so pretty and i had trouble deciding what color to get but I ended up getting this pink color because I just love pink. It's my favorite color and it's like such a good pink. So these are the shoes that I got. I kind of forgot what they're called, but I will have them linked down below in the description box. Um, and they are so comfy. I'm so excited. The colorway that I tried on was kind of like a pastel ombre colorway. It was so pretty. And if I just had unlimited money, I would honestly buy like multiple. They had an all white one, the pastel ombre and the pink, like they were all so cute. Um, but I ended up with the pink. So I'm really excited about those. I am training for a half marathon in December. So got some new shoes because the ones that I have are great. Like I don't have complaints, but the bottoms of them are definitely like wearing down and I've put quite a few miles on them at this point. I got them like a year and a half ago. So I am so excited for those to come in. They should be here like any day now. So I'm sure I'll show you in an update or like another video soon. Um, so I got those from Jarvis. He also got me this hot pink Xbox controller. I actually got a pink Xbox controller, not this past Christmas, but the 2022 Christmas. Um, and it's like a light pink one. Um, but one of the joysticks kind of started drifting. I don't know if you, yeah, anyway, <laughs> if you've ever experienced it, um, it's not the best, but he got me this hot pink one and it's so freaking cute. So now I have a new controller and I'm so excited about it. And he got me these as well, which these are like rechargeable, like battery packs because man, 
Xbox controllers just like suck the life out of uh, <laughs> batteries and they take two AA batteries. So I was like constantly switching them out. Um, but this is actually something that you can just like recharge and it's black on the packaging, but it's actually white. Like the one that he got me is white. So um, it just fits right here where you would put batteries and it just looks seamless with the controller. So Definitely would recommend this. I'm guessing this is probably from Amazon, so I can try to link that as well. I know probably a very small percentage of you care about Xbox controllers, but I had to mention it. And then he also got me, he got me this shirt, which is so cute. I was so excited about this. I actually asked for this specifically for my birthday and I ended up getting two. My parents also got me one, but I asked Jarvis for it and then I told my parents that I asked Jarvis for it and they were like, oh, like we can get it for you for your birthday. And I was like, oh no, it's okay. Like I already asked Jarvis like for it for my birthday, but I guess there was a little bit of miscommunication, but it's fine. I am very happy to have two. If you know what this shirt is, I love you. <laughs> this is actually a Miss Peaches shirt. Um, this is Dave Portnoy's dog, Miss Peaches. He's like the owner of Barstool Sports. And on the back it says, adopt, don't shop. And I just love this shirt so much. All of the like profits get donated to a bunch of different like dog rescues and like the rescue that Miss Peaches was saved from and, or I guess the rescue that saved her from her situation and then also some other like other dog rescues out there specifically ones that like help out pit bulls which i have the like biggest place in my heart for pit bulls i am a pit bull lover we have poncho our dog he's half pit half uh staffordshire terrier and he is literally the sweetest dog in the entire world i just i love pit bulls so much they get such a bad reputation i'm gonna like cry thinking about it but they are just some of the sweetest dogs and miss peaches is a pit bull <laughs> and i just i love her so much or at least the pit mix she's you know i just i just i love miss peaches she has her own instagram dave portnoy posts so many videos of her on tiktok if you don't know her story and like dave's story with her definitely look it up it's like so heartwarming and like to see her go from like not knowing like how to play with toys to like playing like with a ball and like it's just like learning how to like walk up the stairs and stuff i love miss peaches so much so i have two miss peaches shirts and like I said, all of the money goes to helping um, dog rescues and it's the best. So shout out Miss Peaches. And then from my parents, I got a few really exciting things. Oh, also Jarvis got me literally, I totally forgot because I don't have it right here. Jarvis got me the literally the best birthday cake that I've ever gotten in my entire life. He so I had this picture from I think 2019 which is like when we started dating which obviously is like five years ago and it was a picture that I sent him and he saved this picture and then showed it to someone in our um neighborhood who like makes cakes and she made a cake for me for my birthday and it was the best like sweetest birthday cake ever. It was so delicious. We still have some in the fridge. It is so delicious. It's like shaped like a pea. I'll put a picture of it here. I like was so shocked <laughs> when I saw this. And this was also like a huge present from Jarvis. So sweet of him. And it's so yummy. I cannot wait to have some today. It has like um, little chocolate hearts and icing and like flowers icing flowers there's strawberries raspberries there's like sparkles and glitter and it's just like like edible glitter and sugar and just oh it's so yummy there's like a kind of like a jam filling and <laughs> i love it so much so that was another present from jarvis that was so so sweet of him now moving on to the stuff from my parents so they also got me a Miss Peaches shirt, but one of them is, I wore it already, so it's being washed, but this is the <laughs> the clean one. That's why I have that one to show you. Um, but I have a couple of Lush products here. So um, first we have a golden egg. I guess I'll take it out. I'm gonna get glitter all over my fingers. This is always like around for Easter. So I love this golden egg, it smells literally incredible. I just, I can't get over it. And it's like straight up 
gold glitter. This is a bubble bar. So, so good. And then I also got the golden egg shower gel from them. And this, again, smells the same. And it's like gold and sparkly. I don't know if it's picking up on camera how sparkly this is, but it's like unreal. And then I actually have these, which I totally forgot about. These are actually... I was with my mom... I don't even know when actually, but she got me these. I think this was from their Valentine's Day collection. I totally forgot. So there's this little pig soap that smells so good. <laughs> so I have this, this has been sitting in my room because I think I was gonna talk about it in a video, but then like I never did. Um, so this reminded me that I have this. And then we have the Passion Fruit Delight Body Wash. This is such an interesting product. It smells so so freaking good i just like i'm obsessed with this oh my god it's delicious i wonder does it have notes no it doesn't have notes on here but it's like almost like a soft like you could like squish it material it's very interesting but this is like a solid body wash so those two things the pig soap and the body wash i got like in february <laughs> But I also got the golden egg stuff, which I think is from their Easter collection. My birthday is always like somewhere around Easter. So that's the Lush stuff that I got. Then I um, actually asked for some new pans <laughs> for my birthday. I sent my mom the link, but it's like this huge set of pots and pans. I think it's like 14 pieces or something like that. Um, it comes with three pots and three pans there's four lids one for each of the three pots plus one for a pan and then there's four like utensils like cooking utensils um but this is from the brand tfall it's from amazon and i grabbed one to show you because i wasn't gonna like bring them all over here <laughs> um but here's what they look like so it's kind of like this um i don't even know what color it's kind of like a silver-ish color <laughs> on the like bottom of them and then this part is like a uh, ceramic and we have a couple of these pans already the ceramic ones and we love them they're so easy to clean and we've had them for like since before we moved into this house so for over two years now um but and they still are great but we needed some new pots and the other pans that we have were from when we moved in together which was four years ago so we just needed a little upgrade but these were like i feel like a really good deal for what you're getting and i love the way that they look i was thinking i was gonna ask for like the drew barrymore set from walmart but then I was like, ugh, I was like reading reviews and some of them said like the, the paint would like chip and stuff like that. So then I was like, well, can't really go wrong with T-Fall. These have always treated us well. So I got this set for my birthday from them and I'm so excited about it. And then I got a couple of things from Aerie. My mom ordered these for me. These are so freaking cute. I'll link the pot and pan set from Amazon. I'll also link these. Um, but these are, oh, I don't even know what they're called, but they're linked, they'll be linked. Um, but these are like little t-shirts. They're like cropped, kind of like short sleeve t-shirts. So this color I am obsessed with, it's like a kind of like a cream color. Um, and it has this like little kind of like lacy-ish detailing along the neckline, which I didn't even know, but I love Aerie. I just, this shirt that I'm wearing now is from Aerie actually. <laughs> I wish I could have my whole entire wardrobe be Aerie and Lululemon. Those are like my two most used or most worn <laughs> brands. And then also Target, but <laughs> that's where I buy all my clothes. But this little Aerie top is so freaking cute. I love it so, so, so much. So I have this one. And then I also have this color, which is like so bright. It's like not even picking up on camera. This is like neon. And it's again, just like a cropped little, kind of like V-neck, like a little relaxed V-neck cut. And I just thought these were so cute and I thought they would be good to just like wear, but also good for running. Cause I like running in these little like cropped t-shirts. So I got those or my mom got me those for my birthday as well. And then we went to Target like on my birthday and I got a couple of things. So I thought I would show those here as well. So first up, we have this little mitten thing that was for, that is for Luna. This is from Itsy Ritzy. It's like a little mitten that you put on their hand. 
and they can like chew on it. It's like a silicone material. There is literally poncho hair on here. <laughs> um, but she loves to chew on her fingers. Like she puts her hands in her mouth and just like chews. I think she's teething. So um, my mom actually spotted this, I think. And we were like, oh my gosh, this is literally perfect. So we got that for her. I think my mom might've gotten that for her. I don't even remember. <laughs> um, and then I also got this, which is a tank. It's like probably technically a tank top, but I wear it as like a sports bra. I, it's backwards, but um, I have three of these already. Now I have four. I have every single color. It comes in white, black, hot pink, and a really pretty bright blue color. I wear like a regular wired bra and then this on top when I run and then I put a shirt on over it because I need support. I wear a 38H bra and I regular sports bras just don't do it for me. <laughs> but these are also really comfortable just to wear like alone, like around the house if I'm just kind of like relaxing. Um, but these are fantastic. I love them so much. I highly recommend them. I had to get the white one. That was the only color that I didn't have. And then I also got this little set. This is from Cloud island is what it's called and these are these little zip onesies which if you have a baby or you are like buying a present for a baby cloud island zip onesies are literally the best these are new i have not seen this pattern before and they're so soft so we have some we've had them since she was born she literally wears them every single night to sleep she wears one of these like footed onesies they zip from the bottom so when you're changing the diaper like you can just like zip it from the bottom take her legs out and change your diaper and you don't have to take the whole thing off that these are so soft though like it's unbelievable these are way softer than the other ones so it's obviously a different material this is like the softest thing i've ever felt <laughs> so it has the little hand flaps that can cover their fingers it does have like it's completely closed on their feet and I'm just so excited about these. We just washed them so that we could start putting her in these, but it was just a two pack and they're so cute, so soft, so functional. Can't recommend these enough. Um, but yeah, these are the first ones that actually are like this super soft material. The other ones are soft, but these are like unreal. These feel like bamboo pajamas. So that's everything that I have to show you for my birthday haul this year. I hope you enjoyed all of the goodies that I got. Um, I, again, will link everything that I can down below in the description box. Thank you so, so much for watching. I love you so, so much. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one. Bye.